Hey folks, this is Joseph Rampol at AWE TV, and we are here in downtown Santa Clara, California for the Augmented World Expo 2014. In the future, we'll all wear these really cool glasses. <laughs> Welcome everybody to Augmented World Expo 2014. Thank you for joining us in here, out there, everywhere. Um, I'm really honored to be here because this, this is uh, uh, a point in time that I think we're going to remember the same way that I remember unboxing an Apple II back in 1977. So it's fantastic to be here. I've been to every AWE and this is the biggest and best so far by far. This is really exciting the, to see the new Augie and I'm going to get to hold it and I didn't even have to win it. Well, it was really great to take part in the hackathon. It was a lot of fun. And what is the change that you're seeing with uh, eyewear? Well, I think the um, form factors and the cost points and the processing power is finally getting the point that they don't look like these giant clunky helmets or, or things that you can't wear out on the street now. Soon enough, they will be sleek enough that they won't look that much different from a pair of Oakley sunglasses. They really view this technology as an eye-catching way to engage consumers. There's been a real big shift this year, and it's uh, uh, being reflected like in our sales and the interest and the, the number of developers building for our platform, so we're, we're really excited. And the sky's the limit, right? Uh, it, it's virtual reality, so you can create anything. And, uh, and uh, being able to do that with your hands and being able to do it in ways that you, you really already know how to do, it's a great starting point for interaction. Mm, I think there's a lot of excitement around automotive and manufacturing. Moving away from gaming, becoming more, more actionable is, is what we're seeing for sure at this show. Um, I've actually been to every AWE or ARE ever. Uh, this this one seems the most solid, professional. Um, it's no longer, what is AR? What are we going to do with it? It's, look at this really cool thing that I built. It's at the Leap Motion booth. They had Oculus with Leap Motion on it, and that seemed pretty sweet. It was a really wide field of view. Yeah, I feel like Vuforia has, to some extent, grown up with the conference, but to see other companies here and so many Vuforia developers, for example, Daiquiri next to us with a big presence and doing business, it's just a great thing to see. <laughs> AWE has been a huge venue for us. Uh, pretty much got us started last year. Uh, great commercial interest. Actually, uh, for the first time, um, I'm seeing that at AWE. It's also a very good sign how the market is maturing. We had uh, great contacts. Uh, there are a lot of people who are interested in deploying augmented reality in all different verticals. To see, uh, I think for the first year, customers to come to the expo that were already educated about the space and, and had already made it budget provisions and were ready to make purchases. That's really exciting. I think it's a great indicator for the whole industry.